The universe is a strange place. There are black holes which we don't fundamentally understand and which it may be impossible to ever understand. The fundamental laws of the universe are built around uncertainty and probability and four-dimensional space warps. We really don't get where time comes from. And some people like to take the milk of other animals put something in it to make it get moldy, wrap it in wax, put it in a cave for a few years, and then eat it. Strange. Now all of those are weird, but there is another whole level of weirdness to our universe, something much more fundamental. What could be simpler than a circle? One point and one constant, it's radius. That's all you need to describe a circle. But measure the circumference of a circle and divide that length by the length of the distance across the circle, the diameter, and you get this number. A number which has no repeating pattern. A number which, as far as we can tell, represents the closest thing to a random string of numbers we have ever found. You can calculate it, as much of it as you want, but you can never predict by looking at one of its digits what the next digit will be. That's pi. It's been the introduction for many of us to the wonderful world of mathematics. It's the subject of research and speculation. And it's the subject of an informal holiday. In the third month of the year, on the 14th day, ideally at 1.59 and 26 seconds, we celebrate and contemplate and bang our heads against the conundrum that is pie. Traditionally, one should mark the day by baking and consuming a pie. Round one, of course. Sweet or savory doesn't matter. A good excuse to lighten your Monday.